Dave Canales, new coach of the Panthers, talking about Bryce Young, the quarterback. And look, I view anything that he says about Bryce Young skeptically because we all know that this is what the owner wants. And if you want that job, you better want Bryce Young. And you better be all in with Bryce Young. Now, if you're not all in with Bryce Young, <laughs> you don't take the job. But, you know, unlike Ben Johnson, maybe Canales thought, hey, the window's open. I'm jumping through it. Because, frankly, Peter, if there's any job to say no to, and you and I, I think, agree on this 100%, if, there any, if there's any job to say no to, it's a job working for David Tepper. Yeah, and I mean, I think that job would have been deadly without a high first-round draft pick and the owner uh, in-house unless you have a quarterback who you think has a chance. And, you know, Mike, I've been saying this for three months. I don't know how you make a judgment. I think I said it earlier in this show, so I'm going to be a broken record. Um, I don't know how you think you can make some sort of judgment on Bryce Young based on this past year where he just got the crap kicked out of him. And I think that job one uh, for Dan Morgan, the new general manager, and for Dave Canales, the coach of this team, needs to be to make sure that that offensive line is either totally or mostly overhauled in this offseason. Yeah, they got a lot of work to do, and the Bears are going to be using the first overall pick that they earned with a disastrous season. Hi, it's Mike Florio. Thanks for watching PFT on YouTube. Hit subscribe for the latest news and analysis from Pro Football Talk.